so now let us come back and learn this one more concept so till now i taught you <coughs> your based on your pkb value then i taught you based on alkyl group now suppose if this question is asked if compare the basic strength of primary secondary and tertiary you have to be very key, keen in answering this question what basically when i taught you the earlier topic i said <coughs> based on your plus i effect that is your electron releasing effect tertiary is more basic than secondary more basic than primary which is more basic than ammonia because more of the alkyl groups more is electron density in nitrogen more it can release the electrons more is the basicity done now there is one more concept which i'm going to explain you that is hydration effect hydration effect done here in hydration effect uh, the uh, order uh, would be your primary greater than secondary greater than tertiary greater than ammonia when i'm going to combine both the effects plus i effect and hydration effect the actual order uh, the observed order is observed order is always you have to answer on the spaces only your questions observed order would be secondary greater than primary greater than tertiary greater than ammonia ma'am what is this let us see now i've already explained plus i effect in the earlier video now let us see hydration so hydration effect is nothing simple let's see in hydration effect or stabilization of ammonium cation suppose if i'm taking a primary amine i am dissolving it in water what am i getting i am this is going to break the bond and nh2 combines with hydrogen and forms r and h3 plus plus oh minus that's there when i take secondary amine this is going to combine with water and it forms r and h2 plus plus oh minus when i take tertiary <coughs> r in water it's going to combine with this and forms r and h plus plus oh minus now what actually is happening inside this molecule now i took uh, this is this is called ammonium cation now this hydrogen when it's dissolved in water now this is like this okay this is three hydrogen atoms primary has three hydrogen atoms now when i have to show this secondary it has two hydrogen atoms when i have to show tertiary it has only one hydrogen atom these three hydrogen atoms are going to form hydrogen bonding with water just see here one oxygen here one oxygen yes now this is your h h water molecule water molecule water here how many one oxygen from here water molecule one oxygen from here hydrogen bonding water molecule here there's only one hydrogen atom to form a water hydrogen bonding is now observe carefully in primary i mean you have three hydrogen atoms to stabilize the molecule isn't it more stable yes this is most stable in secondary i mean you have only two hydrogen atoms to get stabilized with by hydrogen bonding in tertiary you have only one hydrogen atom to get stabilized by hydrogen bonding so this is least stable now what am i trying to explain more number of hydrogen atoms more is the stability lesser number of hydrogen atoms lesser is the stability because less number of hydrogen bond let us write more number of hydrogen atoms where in primary amine higher stability the second one less number of hydrogen atoms that is in your tertiary mean low stability now simple so based on this hydration effect this is what i did so your hydration effect is explaining me this concept that is what i wrote that reason so more number three are forming three hydrogen bondings here only two hydrogen bonding here only one hydrogen bonding so this whole concept is with forming a bond with water molecule is called hydration effect because of this hydration effect primary has three stabilizing factors three hydrogen atoms hence this is more basic here then comes your secondary because it has two 
then comes your tertiary and ammonia obviously it is the last so this is how you're going to explain plus i effect i explained in the earlier video hydration effect i've explained in this video you're combining both when i've combined both and seen the values this was the final order secondary greater than primary greater than tertiary then ammonia so remember in the exam you have to apply this if they're not given specifically if they give you based on i effect you have to apply this if they say based on hydration effect you have to apply that